Hi students, Assalamu alaikum. I hope you are fine. Dear viewers, today we will talk about one of the important concepts of English language. That is your phrase. Phrase can be defined as a group of words which gives meaning but not complete sense and makes part of a sentence. Students, uh, now we will come to the examples. See the examples with the dawn of in true letter and spirit from pillar to post with flying colors in a detailed manner as soon as in order that students uh, phrase is different from a sentence and a clause when i will record another video when i record another video on sentence and clause i will differentiate there students uh, here i talked about something that is grammatically wrong when i will when i will students this is incorrect because with future tenses we do not use conjunctions of time that i deliberately did when i will is wrong when i will is wrong because we do not use future tense with the conjunctions of time but students here we talk about phrase phrase a group of words which gives meaning but not complete sense and makes part of a sentence now students one by one we will talk about different types of uh, a phrase Uh, hi viewers now we will talk about types of phrases noun phrase example the small house verb phrase example was reading adjective phrase example very tall prepositional phrase example on the table adverbial phrase example very slowly conjunctional phrase example as soon as or in order in order that in order that 
Students uh, now it is very important to talk about the significance of uh, phrase in English language that is this discussion is important students uh, number 1 they embellish they embellish your language number second they beautify your language number third they create diversity in your language number four they bring sense in your writing they bring sense in your writing number five they bring meaning in your writing these are the five important functions of phrases in english language students again work on phrases from journalistic writing from newspapers magazines research papers articles opinions when you read your textbooks you have to underline the important idiomatic phrases related to noun verb adjectives prepositions adverbs conjunctions etc in the next lecture students i will come up with a very innovative lecture on sentence and class till then stay tuned stay safe and give me you were critical you were positive feedback